Hey guys, what's up? This is Edgemeister, and this is the final Iron Banner we're ever gonna get. Ever. No more Iron Banners ever in Destiny 1. I don't even know if we're gonna get Iron Banner in Destiny 2. If we don't, this will be the final Iron Banner ever. It's controlled just like it was in year one the entire time. And, uh, yeah. So, Effort Deed actually has some rotating stock. I think it'd be really cool if, if they did a throwback Iron Banner and you could go to Lord Saladin in the tower and get your three versions of your one and two um, uh, Iron Banner weapons. That would be the best way to finish off Iron Banner, giving us all of the classics like... Uh, Effort eat spear, Felwinter's lie. Holy shit, Felwinter's lie was uh, an infamous one. That's for sure. But yeah, we're here, and uh, we're gonna come over here onto the Destiny 2 PvP map. Honestly, like I went and ran around this as soon as that map was revealed, and this is, aside from some of the caverns that they patched up, the exact same as the PvP map. Uh, there is a platform there that you jump onto, uh, and the map version you can't go inside uh, this tower here there's a whole building here uh, that's open and there's just a bunch of caves and stuff that are closed in this version that uh, are obviously open and it, it really does make more sense because this area was kind of like okay there's nothing to do over here or whatever but it really makes sense for it being and there's a cave right here the PvP map I feel like it was a built in Destiny 2 and then just ported it into Destiny 1. But yeah, here it is. First of all, I'm just going to check. Uh, I need to... Ooh, is there something to delete? Yeah, I'm just going to delete that. Fuck it. Speaking of Felwinter's Lie... <laughs> yeah, there's... Uh, I, I didn't forgot I had my Felwinter's Lie here. Um, this used to have shot package here. I re-rolled it again, but... Um, yeah, this is a Dark Below Felwinter's Lie. Um, I've been kind of trying to go nostalgic here. I need boots like I used to have. Uh, I need... Yeah, I used to use these boots, but I'm using these because they have great perks. I'm going to just switch over to these guys just because those are the boots I used in year one. That or Bones of Ao, which, why am I not using Bones of Ao? Um, gauntlets. Uh, I, I I think I used these gauntlets. Oh, no, no, no. I used these gauntlets in year one right here. And then this this cloak here. This, this is my year one look, honestly. And I used this exact helmet as well in year one so this is my year one guardian basically right here nostalgic oh yeah I was gonna check my bounties so yeah um, the stock actually refreshes daily which kinda sucks I wish there's more I'll just hand those in I still have oh I still have iron banner bounties on this character but uh, you bet I'm gonna be playing some iron banner uh, so yeah like I said refreshes daily even yours, Lord Garden. Now, so in 12 hours, are going to refresh. Let's just take a look at these weapons. We have Luck in the Chamber, Firefly, Quick Draw, Feather Mag, Brace Frame, Reinforced Barrel, and this stuff here. Not the best, not the worst, though. And the Sniper Rifle here, the Laughing Heart. I already have a God Roll of this. But a Hidden Hand, holy shit, Quick Draw, holy shit. Injection Mold, holy shit. This is a God Roll uh, for PvP if you want it. Uh, sadly, PvP is in a really shitty spot right now. Uh... Farewells are a So, uh, yeah, there's there's a last Iron Banner. I thought I'd just make a video on this. I stopped making Iron Banner videos, I think, through year two. I think I stopped. But, yeah, this is the final Iron Banner ever. I think I might even show you guys my first Iron Banner video. I was mistaken thinking it was the second Iron Banner. Not Back then, I didn't even know it was once a month. Like, And year one me was such a noob. Uh, I think just for nostalgia's sake, I'm going to download my last, my, well, my very first Iron Banner video off of YouTube, and I'm going to put it on there. Sorry if, if you can hear a fan right now. My computer's kind of going crazy, just absolutely crazy, because um, I'm actually rendering all my videos for that Destiny 2 a Day series. So pretty soon here, I'm going to start uploading all of them, and you're going to be seeing a Destiny 2 video every day up until launch. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be absolutely amazing. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and switch over to that video. I'm going to download that, and we're going to do that right away. Oh, what is this? 
This is the Iron Banner. Welcome back, guys. This is Edgemeister, and welcome to my video where I just talk about Iron Banner, I guess. So, I am an Iron Banner virgin. I've never been to the Iron. I've never gone to the done anything with the Iron Banner. It looks like this is exclusively Dark Below. So, if you do not have the DLC, you are screwed. I'm sorry if you may hear stomping. That would be upstairs. There is stomping. But there's level advantages enabled, so I don't know how that's going to be. Again, people who have played the last two Iron Banners will know, not me though, I have no idea. So let's go and see what's up with the Iron Banner. So yeah, like I said, I've never done any Iron Banner events before, and well, I don't have any raid gear, so it'd be perfect to try. Oh, it looks like I also have an engram that I can go ahead and uh, try to unlock on camera for you guys, see if I get anything cool. Again, I'll do that after I look at uh, the Iron Banner guy name face. Don't know what his name is yet, because I don't think I've, yeah, I, uh, when the first Iron Banner came out, I was already kind of out of destiny at that point. Um, you know, just coming to it casually again back. But now I'm back full force in, into destiny here. Uh, I do want to try to continue Halo, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to, but yeah, the Iron Banner is here and I'm excited. So how many bounty slots do I have? Um, I could probably finish these guys really, really fast, and that'll free up some spots. These guys, I could probably finish up fast as well. This guy, kill during public event. So I guess I just have to be there during a public event. But yes, as you can see, the special events door is open. This is fantastic, guys. Um, just a question for anybody who does not have any DLC. Just to ask, uh, is this open for you if you do not have DLC? Because I know for sure, well, obviously, because I, it's open for me, that it'll have DLC then. But I don't know if it's going to be open for people without DLC. So here it is. It's pretty grand. Get a, a nice photo with a nice man. You're in the way. I'll do it afterwards. Uh, okay, so let's. T okay, Lord Saladin. Hello, Lord Saladin. So it looks like we have to get these bounties. Also, hmm. My brother said that you ha could buy this without any ranks, but it looks like you do need rank to get these. Apparently, these boost your uh, stuff. So I guess when I get to rank 1, I'll buy this guy. But yeah, so... Okay. Okay. Ooh, that's gonna be a hard one. Auto rifle headshots! Okay, I need some auto, auto, good auto rifles, one of these. 5 headshot sprees, and 10 guardians with a machine gun. Okay. So, yeah, I'm going to have to complete those, get my Iron Banner rank up, get some emblems and stuff, and get to work, because I need to get some of these level 32 armor things. So, uh, I'll go over all of them, I'll go over the weapons first, because you guys might find those a little bit more exciting. So, let's go over this guy, the Fellwinders, Fellwinters, sorry, Fellwinters lie. So... Uh, return to sender, kills with this weapon grab, bonus ammo directly to the magazine. That's pretty sweet. Um, of course, increased damage. Uh, let's go fast. Range finder, aiming this weapon increases the impact of range. Okay. Upgrade damage, upgrade damage. Um, okay. Ooh, this is. Uh, lightweight's a pretty good perk. Sweet. So that it was uh, this guy, and now we have Gillian, Gill Gillian's, Gillian's demise. I don't even know. It's a scout rifle, though. Um, but yeah, this guy has outlaw precision kills with this weapon. Dramatically increased reload speed. Pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Uh, let's see. Firefly precision kills with this weapon cause targets to explode. Oh, that's cool. Alright, now let's go over the things that may not be as exciting, which would be the weapons. So we have uh, some gauntlets, go 
Wait, for what? Um, I think this is just for Hunter, so uh, since I'm a Hunter, it'll show me Hunter stuff. Uh, but yeah, you have some gauntlets. I'll, I'll just quickly scroll over them. I don't think we really need any stuff, really. Um, so these are rank 3. So these would be the only ones I'd get, probably, up to. I'd, rank 3 would be the highest I'd get during the Iron Banner. So... Um, let's see. So this one has increased reload speed with auto rifles. And causing damage with a melee attack reduces your grenade cooldown. It's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Increase reload speed with scout rifles. I think that's auto, yeah, and scout. And cause damage with a grenade reduces your melee cooldown. Ah, so this is like vice versa kind of thing. Ah, so this is like you like to throw grenades and long range. This guy's short range, pretty much. Is it the same with this? Carry more auto rifles, scout rifle. Okay, yeah. These are like combined, so like you combine uh, these guys with these guys. Yeah, they're, they're called the same thing, so I can't really change what they're called. And obviously this is a lot better than mine. Oh, and the intellect and discipline are different. Yeah. So yeah, this is pretty awesome. Iron Banner's back. First time I'm going to be playing it. So I'm hopefully going to play it a lot. Hopefully live streaming on the weekend. I don't know how long these things last. But yeah, I'm going to grind out not only the Iron Banner stuff, but also the bounties I have left over so that I can go ahead and grip grab myself some more iron banner bounties sweet so for sticking to the end of this video we are going to encrypt a rare engram exciting i know this is so exciting oh <laughs> i have max cash can't you get that and we get something that i will throw out amazing i know right oh oh <laughs> okay okay so yeah I need to go ahead and get a selfie with, I already forget his name, I'm horrible with names. If I ever forget your name, I'm sorry, just like, look at, I'm forgetting this major character name here. So let's go over here, let's get ourselves a nice little selfie. Oh yeah, Lord Saladin, nice. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, I'll see you guys in the next one. Hopefully I'll be live streaming this more, hopefully I'll do more hashtag IDARB, I know that's been really popular on my channel, and hopefully I will do more uh, Halo as well. Let's, uh, we'll see how that plays out in terms of whether things will be fixed or not, but yes, I will see you guys in the next episode, and if you've been noticing at the end of the videos I've been kind of just cutting out, and that's because uh, it takes a second. Um, yeah, my, my Elgato software is a little bit diff different. Different. See ya.